Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an amazing day and today's makeup look is inspired by my favorite Alia Bhatt. I totally love her makeup looks. She keeps it so simple and yet so gorgeous. And also in this video, I've used an affordable eyeshadow palette and I think it works absolutely amazing. So without any delay, let's begin. So the first thing I noticed in her makeup look was a very dewy and glossy base and to get that sort of a base, I'm using a generous amount of this Nivea Light Moisturizer. Next, I'm using this Nykaa Prep Me Up Primer to blur out the pores and give a really smooth base. As this is a dewy and a glowy makeup look, so I'm using a liquid highlighter here. I'm using this highlighter underneath my makeup for a naturally glowing skin and now I'll spread this all over my face and blend it out. Okay, so as this is a no foundation look, so I'm directly moving on to my Pond's BB Cream in the shade Original. This is one of my favorite BB Cream in the drugstore category and I think it gives a really natural and a weightless finish, leaving the skin extremely glowy at the same time. Moving on to my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 20 Sand. I'm gonna apply it underneath my eyes, on my T-zone and around my mouth area to kind of brighten the entire look. So the second thing I noticed in Alia Bhatt's makeup look was bold, bushy and thick brows. So I'm using this Wet n Wild Eyebrow Kit to do my brows. Moving on to eyes, I am using this Nykaa Sundowner Stunner Palette, it's their latest launch and you can see the shades are really beautiful. I am using this beautiful soft brown colour as my transition shade and I am going to place it above my crease. Now I am going to blend this in circular motions, taking it a little bit towards the lid. I am using this beautiful orange colour in my crease, darker than the transition shade and I am using a dome shaped brush to add in the colour. Now I'm using the same orange colour that I used in my crease on my lower lash line for a more edgy and defined look. Now I'm using a black eye pencil on my upper lash line and using a dome shaped brush I'm gonna smudge it for a smoky liner look. Using the same black eye pencil I'm gonna tight line my lower lash line. Now I'm going to use this Maybelline Hyper Curl Mascara. This not only voluminizes but this also lengthens the lashes. So I'm going to apply 2 to 3 coats of this mascara as you're not going in with false lashes. Now I'm going to use this Lancome Star Bronzer. I love the applicator. I just love everything about it. Just going to warm up my face a little bit for that summer bronze look. Using my beauty blender, I'm going to blend this all in so that it doesn't look harsh. I'm using the same brown shade from the Nykaa palette that I used as my transition shade to contour my nose and with the help of a beauty blender, I'm blending this all in. Now I'm using my Chanel blush. I just love this one in the high-end category. It gives such a natural and pink looking color to the skin. Now I'm going in with this Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in the shade Molten Gold 100 and I'm using this MAC brush. I think it's really compact and travel friendly. I'm going to apply this on all the high points of my face. For my lips, I'm using this beautiful matte lipstick from Nykaa. Now I'm using a slightly lighter shade to get the actual color that I need. So this is the final look and I hope you all like it and if you like it give it a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments below if you would like to see more such looks and most importantly don't forget to subscribe.